or if um what's up guys hope you guys are having a great blessed day and yeah let's get into this video so i'm gonna try something a little different i wanted to try doing a video like this a long time ago but it was super hard to figure out how to do this so it was so the video didn't come up but now because i saw the Bass pro video got a lot of views like a hundred and something views so thank you so much guys um we don't know if it was it we don't know if it was because of the tracker or because of just bass pro so i'm gonna do both videos separately now i'm gonna do one with the tracker and now one with bass pro so this video about bass pro is gonna be i'm gonna choose a couple of things probably not just a couple of things but some stuff and put it in the item or in the shopping cart just we're just gonna we're just gonna go shopping i'm not gonna buy this stuff because i don't got no money yet and we're saving up to go to that trip still get ready for that still going to the trip but like i said probably not gonna buy this we're just gonna look at like we're probably gonna do about like 12 things what are the 12 things if i had the money to buy that's gonna be the th or the title of the video if i had enough money to buy 12 things from my wish list at Bass Pro. Okay, that's the other title of the video. But I'm going to fishing. So, as you see here, I'm going to shop and the fishing line. So, we're going to do lures, we're going to do frogs, we're going to do beginner bass tackle box, tackle storage. What are you going to do? We're going to do this. Trust me. Oh, this is kind of cool. Oh, there's a little more. Oh, no. Oh, that's cool. Like, it's a little kit. Comes with all this stuff. Smart, smart. Smart. Swinging. Frog hook. Smart. Oh, that's cool. Guess you can't pick out your color by that. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna go fishing. So going fishing, we're gonna go to bait casters because I want to see what new bait casters we have. <sighs> okay. I'm a lose guy. It sounds very bad, but you know the real, like the brand lose. I'm the. I I like their brand. They have a good brand. So, when I'm looking at rods, I know we try to go to them, but they're kind of a little expensive, to be honest. So, I think I have that big here. Okay. See, like 169, that's kind of expensive. I do say myself. Ooh, that's a nice one. That's the new one that just came out, if I'm not mistaken. bad that's kind of bad dudes carbon fiber you know I'm looking very carbon fiber I've never actually had a bait caster that is loose loose No, moles, lose. I don't know how to pronounce that, but I've never had a bait catcher that is that brand. So one day, guys, one day we have to. The prophet prophecy has spoken. It's true. I really like this one. I've been looking at this one. If you hear cats meowing, I'm sorry. Carbon fiber, I think. That's bad. I kind of want that. We're going to add that to cart. Ain't what? Mm -hmm. We added a cart. That's one thing that I would like to get. 
Now we have our, what was it? Real. Yeah, get a rod. That's just, that's just common. You need a rod to fish with a reel. So, because we got blues, now we gotta get a loose fishing rod. Oh, no, I know what to get. I don't think they have it. So if you haven't really noticed, I'm a really big Guggen fan. I love the brand. I have a hat, I have glasses, I have a shirt, I have baits, as you really know. Uh, they, not that long ago, came out with a um, fishing rod. And it looks really cool. So, if I can find it, I'm definitely gonna add that to cart. Oh wait, they, ooh, they might have it. Uh, no, I don't think they have it. That's very happy. I thought I almost got it right there. I think I spoke good when I did it. How about next video I make? is going to the Guggen store, not in real life, I wish, Guggen store on the internet and picking out 12 things. I like that. We might do that. I think we're gonna do that, guys. Okay, guess we gotta go back to the other rods. Rods are the evil. You just gotta look through them. That's all that I do, guys. That's all we gotta do. That rod looks nice. Those rods look nice. I'm surprised there's not any lo loose rods. There's a new one. <gasps> I've never heard of this brand. Nice. We'll do this one. It looks like a good rod. Okay, now that we got our rod, the reel, now we gotta get our fishing weights. It's just, it's just, it's not. So we gotta get, we gotta choose two. We'll do two out of each category. I said that right and I'm very impressed. So there's hard bait lures. Sorry, that's hard for me to say. There's soft bait lures, there's spinner baits, buzz baits. Uh, bass jigs and view all, but we're gonna uh, we're gonna choose out of all of those or those categories. So first we're gonna do hard baits. Okay. <sighs> hard baits. Right now, I'm gonna be honest. Hard baits are really hard to fish right now, where we live. Like none of our family during this time, like this year, we haven't caught a fish on a lure like a hard bait like a, a hard bait or hard lure, whatever it's called. We haven't caught a fish on one of those yet. Uh, I almost did on a little, little one because right now, kind of the bass here are not too, too big. They're not huge. So it's gonna be very hard to find one that I think would might catch a fish. I just don't know. We're probably gonna have to go to Goobie and that's the only baits that I know I get. We're gonna check out the video. Bits. 
I think they have soft baits here, but I don't think they had hard baits. Ooh. We're gonna add this to card too. We have to get it. I'm sorry, I have to. So I got distracted there for a lot. Now we're gonna have to go back to hard baits. Probably gonna go to Dugan for soft baits, but right. so okay. Mm -hmm. So that like I don't know. That's kind of what is kind of popular as what my dad said. Like he always used to catch bass on that bass on that like everywhere he went. Like he always caught a fish on those type of lures. So we're probably gonna have to do that because I bought one. It's just I haven't gone fishing yet to try it out. So probably gonna get one of those. That's like the exact one that I got. This one. Okay. Mm -hmm. We gotta find a good one, like one that we think, like, that's gonna catch a fish. That's gonna catch a fish. Which one looks like that? Honestly, some of these lures, I think my grandpa owns. He gave me, like, a, a, like a little box. They didn't have that many. They had three of them, but they're old lures. Super old lures. I'm not bother. We haven't found anything yet, guys. And I can't make this video that long. Okay, oh my goodness, guys. We haven't found anything. And my, my grandpa gave me that lure right there. It's pretty cool lure. I think we're gonna go with this one. We do it quickly. We have to, guys. I can't find anything else. I can't find anything. Which color? What do you do with this color? Yeah, that's a pretty color. That's not the color, but that's one. That's the color. What do you do? What's this? Oh, the leopard figure. Right? I thought I got, I gotta find one more. We gotta make it. If we don't make it at 12, that's fine. I found that. Okay. We go back to hard beats. Oh, wait. Oh, no, okay. Go with hard beats. The hoary. Oh, we'll go 35. We're like straight 35. Thirty-five isn't nothing. Come on, we gotta find something. Oh my goodness, there's nothing, guys. Nothing. Oh my goodness, there's literally nothing here. Uh, if I could find a, oh wait, oh my, that's sixteen dollars. I ain't buying that. I'm not buying them. Try to find them. What are they called? Whopper poppers? What is that? This. It's $16. I ain't putting that in. Oh my goodness. Bass Pro ain't cheap. Okay. Come on. We gotta find something. Mmm. Choose this rattle trap. I have to choose something, guys. I have, no, wait, wait, wait. I found something. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Please go there, please go there. Yeah, I'll choose this. I'll choose this, guys. No, I'm the wrong thing. I gotta go back to one. There's one thing 
I think that I would do this. I would do this. I think this would do good. But we had to get a color that would actually do good. Okay. Ooh, yeah, that color. That's a card. Okay. We got two lures now on our base. Now we can't go. It's a soft bait. Okay. Soft bait lures. We're probably just going to head to Guggen. That's all, all the base that I get. It's going to show Guggen here. Positive. That's not good. I can tell what's good in. Just by looking at it, guys. That's how bad. That's how much Guggen I own. Because I can just look at Guggen and be like, okay, that's Guggen. Okay, that, this is Guggen. Yeah, I think that. I don't know. I think I might get a lizard. Really? Have you ever seen ones? Like they look like those. I show, I show these. I think I might get these. And get it in like a weird color. This would do good. Yeah. Yeah, that a card. Okay, we got one soft bait. And then I might just do good. Okay. Why is it loading so much? That's what I caught my fish on. I think I might do pumpkin. I think that that would be a good color. I think we're gonna get a big one. Four inches. I think that was four inches. I don't know. Okay, we got two soft baits now. Now we gotta go back and go spinny baits and bug baits. I've never uh, I don't know no one in my family that's caught a fish on one of these. Like simple, like it's just like it's very hard to catch a fish on one of these nowadays. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do one spinner bait and one buzz bait, just so I can even it out. You know what? I'm not even gonna do these. I'm just gonna do a buzz bait, buzz bait, buzz bait, buzz bait. Like, there's no chance that I catch a fish on one of these nowadays. Like, there's no chance. No chance. I'm just gonna go straight to 70. Like I said, there's literally no chance that I catch a fish on those because, like, I know no one that has caught a fish on this. I have very low faith in this. So, just gotta find this buzz bait. Yes, where's the buzz baits? Oh, 
of my which is one of these. Okay. Okay, I gotta let this thing load because my computer is taking a very long time today. Don't know why. Okay, do that go. And it's got I see. Add that one card. Now we go to jigs. Best jigs. like a dark blue color. Probably gonna do this one. Yep, do that one. Add that one card. Add a card. Did I add that one card? I don't know if it added added it added it. I don't know how to say that. I think it did. It says there's eight things. Yes, I did. Oh, I didn't add the uh, Jake, the song Jake. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I ain't mad. We have this one jig down now. We just gotta get a jig. Like I said, going straight to nine. Okay, the worst aren't nine. Ooh. I'm gonna pick a weird color. Like if you see that in the water, you're like, I hate it. It looks disgusting. That's one. That's one I want to give off to the bass. Like, that's pretty much. So yeah. If I gotta get a line, get this. What? Why do I do this? Pick that color. You yeah, add the card. Add the card. Okay, we're at twelve. That's actually pretty good. Uh, now we oh, now we gotta go line. Okay, that one. There's actually no fishing line on her. That's weird. Okay, so. I do not know how to spell mine. Line. I'm gonna be a little dead honest with you guys. Don't know how to spell mine. Okay. It's weird that it doesn't do line here. Mm -hmm. You don't need mine. Okay. Let's check out what we got. Because it's been a 23 minute video. Okay, go to this. To the cart. I don't know what you call it, the shopping cart, whatever. Okay, first.
first item we got, $199. Lou's Baitcaster Pro I don't know, pro speed something. Okay. Okay. 199. Big caster. Bass Pro Shop. 149 for the rod. A lot of money. Second, Dugan, the tackle, the tackle crate, and whatever you call it. Uh, 1699. And then the hard bait. $7. The Whopper Whopper, ten dollars. The Zoom Baby Brush. What? Don't know what that is, but that's fine. Hog. Guggen calls Guggen called it. Guggen calls them. Uh, was it trench hog? Trench hogs. It's a weird name, but I guess that's what they're. Yeah, brass, brass hogs. I don't know. I tried. Okay, four dollars. Uh, Zoom. Zoom is a very good brand. Like, they're very cheap, but they're super good. Like, I really like them. And then Duke and Bait. Duke and Baits. Sorry. Uh, five dollars and ninety nine. The spin or the Buzz Bait. Seven dollars and ninety nine cents. Um, the Swim Jig. Eight dollars and nineteen cents. And the just normal Bass Jig. Five dollars and 49 cents so let's see how much it all would cost it normally shows at the bottom total would be 416 dollars i definitely don't have that much money to spend right now so i'm not gonna do it but that's for the end of the video i just kind of wanted to see if the reason why the video got that many views was because of what's it, Bass Pro or the tracker video. So I am going to do a video pretty soon about the tracker coming up pretty soon. So yeah, I think this is the end of the video guys. Thank you guys for sticking around and watching the video because that means a lot. Give this video a thumbs up. Um, tell it to all your friends. Um, give this video a uh, what do you what do you call it like give this video like, subscribe to this video guys uh i think this is the end so yeah i'll see you guys later